conservationists have called for a ban of up to 20 years on hunting dugongs and turtles in the Great Barrier Reef Marine Park. The federal government preparing draft legislation to address the issue. It takes months, sometimes years, to rehabilitate turtles who come into this centre with injuries. These turtles are under enormous amounts of pressures out there. There are pressure from loss of nesting beaches, loss of feeding grounds, and hunting is just an added pressure that they just don't need. Jenny Gilbert says she released a turtle three months ago, which disappeared the next day. She suspects somebody hunted the turtle. She's now speaking out, saying she's had enough and wants a 20-year ban on hunting turtles to allow the animals to breed properly. One in a thousand turtles makes it through to adulthood. That's a very low number. So we need to look at it. There are similar concerns about the hunting of dugongs. Now, if anybody can tell me we should be hunting vulnerable animals who don't know the numbers, they're nuts. Member for Leipart, Warren Edge, says hunting is currently forbidden in green zones but wants this extended to all of the Great Barrier Reef Marine Park. But I think it's important that in doing this, this is something we do with the full collaboration of our rangers and uh, with their support and empowering them to make it happen. But conservationists are disappointed they're yet to see Mr Edge's proposal. The last time the last election came around, uh, he and... Greg Hunt promised to ban hunting uh, turtle and dugongs for a minimum of two years, have a moratorium and count the numbers. That didn't happen. So I want to see this watered down version that they got now, and then we'll make a decision on whether we support it or not. Brianna Piazza, Win News.